Hey friends, so I'm back with an update on our mealworms, or really I should say darkling beetles, because nearly all of them has have transformed and reached their adult stage of darkling beetle. Um, so it's been about a week and a half since I last showed you. Remember this was the pineapple house that I separated all of the pupa into, or I think there were about a dozen of them. And as you can see, almost all of them have transformed into darkling beetles. I pulled out one in particular, I put it on the lid of the little pineapple house because I want you to see it's pretty cool. So this beetle is still sort of in the process of emerging from its pupa. I squirm around, he's okay. So they're just, you can kind of see the outside shell that's molting off and his little legs kicking out. So he's still kind of working through, emerging through the shell of his pupa. I'm gonna put him back in here. And you can actually see some of the skins, the shells that have been molted from the pupa kind of laying around. And they tend to hide, so a lot of them are underneath here. I think it's interesting, so I'm actually not super familiar with darkling beetles, but they do have wings. To my knowledge, they do fly, but so far, every time I've opened up the tank, none of them have tried to fly away. So I wonder what that is about. And I'll show you, I'm gonna put this pineapple cover house and put a fresh apple slice in there for him. I'm gonna show you the full tank. As you can see, we've got tons more darkling beetles crawling around than we did before. Now there are still a few pupa in here, definitely. You can see some right there. And actually there are even a few mealworms in there, larva stage still right there. Um, but the majority of them have transformed into darkling beetles. So it is just about time for me to decide what to do with them. If it is safe for me to let go into the environment, I'll probably just let them go outside on my porch. Um, but I need to make sure that that is safe to do so because if they are, since we got them in the mail, I don't know if they're native to New England and if it is safe to do so. Um, you never want to release species into the environment if you don't know it, that it's safe to do so because they could really mess up the um, ecosystem and the food chain. So I'll stay tuned. I'll give you an update on what's going to happen with our little darkling beetles.